and in Mays family. Real quick before we get into the video, the shout outs for today go to every single one of my Mays family members. If you are not a part of the Mays family membership, you are missing out on exclusive content and everything else. So go ahead, click the description. Okay. Go ahead and click the link in the description box below and join the Mays family today because again, you are missing out. Also, go ahead and smash that like button for me real quick if you don't mind. Matter of fact, even if you do mind, go ahead and smash it. Because I worked hard on this video. And it took forever to end. So I'd appreciate it. Please make sure to also subscribe if you are not subscribed and leave a comment below let me know what your favorite part of the video was. So thank you guys so much for watching. I love and appreciate all of you and I hope you all enjoyed the video, alright? Well, good morning, Tom. Somebody's a little late. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you. I wasn't sure whether or not you were coming in today. <laughs> Get it? Because <laughs> you do the weather? <laughs> now that was a good one, Jim. Oh, man, 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 I know, I know, I'm so hilarious. <laughs> I should be a comedian. But seriously, Tom, how are you? Are you ready to give this city the best weather report they've ever seen? You know it. As a matter of fact, I stayed up all night staring at the sky and studying the clouds. So I know exactly what the weather's gonna be today. Everybody don't need to worry. It's gonna be absolutely beautiful. I'm talking about not a cloud. Oh well, what are you gonna do? <laughs> hey, Michael Jordan didn't score every touchdown, did he? Am I right? <laughs> anyway, like I was saying, of course I'm ready. I was born to do this. As you can see, I got my coffee and I'll be standing all day so I brought my good shoes. I mean, so what? I stand here in the same spot for eight hours repeating myself every couple minutes for people who don't give a damn about the weather or give a damn about me. I mean, we all know the only reason they watch this channel is for Big Booty Betty. Ain't that right, Betty? You know it, baby. Damn, skank. But I'm just grateful to be here. So to answer your question, yes, Jim, I'm ready to give this city the best weather report they've ever seen. And I put that on guard. Back to you. I'm a natural. Only thing I'm ready to do is go home. I don't even know what I'm here for. Who you know still watch the news? Matter of fact, who you know still watch TV besides your grandparents? Exactly. Nobody. Not a soul. Hell no, nah, I ain't ready. You want to know what I really am? I'm nervous. And you want to know why I'm nervous? I'm going to tell you why I'm nervous. Because they're waiting for a reason to fly my ass. Oh, you don't believe me? All right. Watch this. Hey, Siri. What's the weather for today? Today will be partly cloudy with scattered thunderstorms. The high temperature is 65 and the low is 34 degrees Fahrenheit. The wind is blowing 5 miles per hour out of the northeast. The UV index for today is 3 and the humidity for today is 31%. Would you like to hear more? Would you like to hear more? <laughs> I went to school for 6 years. I got 3 degrees. I got $100,000 in student loan debt. And I don't even know what a damn UV index is. <laughs> I got something. What the hell you need me for? She the genius. I just be guessing. Just watch. <laughs> they gonna let me go any day now. I already know it. I don't know when it's gonna be, but I already. Hey, what's going on, Tom? How you doing? Oh, <clears throat> and by the way, when you get a chance, can you step into my office? Thanks. No need to put your bag down. It won't be long. Once again, if you have any information on a man that kidnapped the Statue of Liberty, please make sure to call the authorities immediately as police are still searching for the suspect. In other news, let's go to Jim for the weather. Jim, looks like we're getting wet. And you're absolutely right. If we take a look at our Doppler radar here. You can see that um, there's a little bit of rain moving in from the west. Nothing too crazy. I would say maybe about 15, 20 inches. That's it. I mean, a little water ain't never hurt nobody, right? <laughs> so with that being said, if you have any birthday parties or events planned, you should be good. I wouldn't even worry about it. In my professional Harvard opinion, the rain should be stopping in about five to 10 minutes, max. Now, we're gonna go to some live footage right outside the station. If you look behind me, you can see it's drizzling, nothing to worry about. Now, if you look closely, you can see. Is that my car? I know that ain't my. Well, damn. I... <laughs> Back to you, Jim. Well, it looked like the government decided to make it storm today, so I guess we just. Hello? Oh, I can't say that? All right, everybody listen up, because I'm only going to say it one time. All you got to do is look out the window to see what the hell going on, but for some reason, you rather sit there and wait for me to tell you what's going on, so I'm going to make it clear to you right now. If you're in the green, you in trouble. If you're in the yellow, you in even more trouble. If you're in the red, your ass is in danger. So with that being said, let me put it simple for you. If I were you, I would get to safety quick. Everything is flooding underwater. Submerged. There's a lot of water out there. I'm talking about so much water, you can't even see the street. Look behind me. Do you see what's going on outside? Not to mention, it's going to be a bunch of thunder, lightning, heavy winds, hailing. That's what it got. It's going to sound like a Marvel versus DC superhero movie out there. So it should be common sense, but I'm going to say it one time for my slow folk. Keep your ass indoors. Because you will be a goner.
All right, everyone, listen. I've just been informed that there is currently a tornado watch over our area. Jim, is that correct? Well, Tom, it actually just became a tornado warning, meaning the tornado has now touched down on land. If you take a look behind me, you can see the slight breeze from the storm. I would say the winds right now are blowing about 75, 80 miles per hour, some slight. There's absolutely no need to be afraid. As a matter of fact, feel free to stand on your porch and watch the storm, because I got to tell you, it's a beauty. We are now going to cut to Steve, who's live on the ground right now with the storm. Steve, what's going on out there? Woo! <laughs> Look at that storm! Look at that tornado! It's absolutely beautiful! <laughs> I just want to jump in it. I, I live for moments like this. Folks at home, if you missing this storm, you need to go look at it right now. It's an absolute beauty out there. You know? I just want to be out there. I just wanna... Matter of fact, we can be out there. I'm going to pull over. <laughs> look at that storm. Look at that tornado. It's absolute. Alright, everybody listen. They just called me and told me it's a tornado warning. You know what that means? That means it's on the way. Everybody should be panicking. Look at these clouds. You see these clouds? I ain't never seen no clouds that dark. Now listen to me, I ain't trying to scare you or nothing, but your ass better be scared. The way I see it, you got two options. Get to safety or get dead. That's it. Nobody should be outside. Stay away from the windows. If you ain't got a tornado shelter, get in the bathtub. If you ain't got a bathtub, get under the table. If you ain't got a table, what in hell? Goodbye. Look at these winds. You see these winds? Do you see? Hello? We got somebody on the ground with the storm? Who was stupid enough to go out there? Oh hell, they don't they don't pay us nearly enough to do that. Alright. Well folks, we're gonna cut to the food that went out there. Uh Steve? Where the hell is Steve at? Where the hell is Steve? Yeah. Ain't this about a Ain't you supposed to be outside? Hell no, I ain't going out there. You know it's a tornado out there? We know that. You supposed to be the one reporting on it. <laughs> That ain't in my job description. You take your stupid ass out there and get it. I ain't going. When I put that on guard. Well, we just got good news for kids and maybe not so good news for parents. Tom, wanna tell us what that is? Absolutely, Jim, I sure can. Guess what, kids? If you open up your window and look outside, you might see some fluffy white stuff on the ground. And what does that mean? That's right. It's snowing. I mean, sure, the temperature is negative 15 degrees. I mean, sure, the wind is blowing, so it's actually negative 30 outside. I mean, sure, it's black ice on the road, so cars just slipping and sliding everywhere. But it look good out there, don't it? So go have some fun. Build you a snowman. And I ain't really too sure if it's safe, but make you some snow cones. Why not? Bow, bow. Have a snowball fight. Now, I will say it is kind of weird to have snow in July, especially because it was 105 degrees yesterday. But oh well, let's cut to Steve on the ground. Steve, how's that snow looking? As you can see, it's uh, absolutely beautiful out here. <laughs> You know, I, uh, I wouldn't want to be anywhere else on a day like today. <laughs> you know, it's a uh, little chilly, but it ain't that bad. <laughs> Woo! That wind is a mother Steve, watch your goddamn language. We live. My bad. Uh, <laughs> snow is blowing behind me really hard. And, 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 uh, uh. Steve? Steve, you all right? I believe Steve just froze. Have fun, kids. It's cold as hell out there. I ain't get out of this bed for a damn thing. My car stuck in snow. My water froze, so I can't wash my ass. School got canceled, so my kids tearing up the house. What I'm supposed to do? Sit down out there! It's a whole blizzard out there. And do you know my manager called this morning talking about, it's just a little snow, you be all right. You damn right I'll be all right. Right here in this bed. <laughs> he tripping. Don't pay me enough for that. All right, that's enough. Go and cut to Steve. Ain't nothing to see here. <laughs> I'm going back to bed. I hate my job, I hate my manager, I hate my coworkers. Why I gotta be out here? It's cause I'm black, hey. If I ain't need this money, goddammit, I'd quit right now. My hands is froze, toes is froze, my, my nuts is froze, I'm cold everywhere. As a matter of fact, everybody at the station, y'all can kiss my... Now, Tom, I don't know if what I just heard was correct, but did they just say that it's a hurricane headed in our direction? Not just a hurricane, Jim, a category six super hurricane. The name of this hurricane is Hurricane Big Bro Savage. If you look here behind me, you can see that the storm is moving rapidly in our direction. Now, the state has issued a state of emergency and has told us all to evacuate. But if we were to evacuate, who would keep you up to date on the storm? Exactly, and that's why we're here. <laughs> to fight the storm with you. No need to worry, folks. Everything will be all right. It probably won't even be that bad. If you look behind me, you can see for yourself. That's just a little windy. No need to worry. Look at that. My force produced more wind than that. I mean, you might lose your roof. I mean, your car might get blown away. Your whole house might get swept off. But guess what? You might live. And I'll be right here praying for you. 
in this warm and cozy, stormproof news station. We do this because we care about your safety. That's all that matters. Excuse me, sir. Sorry to bother you. Would you like something to drink while you wait? Yes, ma'am. I'll take a... I'll take a Sprite with no ice. All right. And can I get you anything else? You know what? Let me get... Let me also get them, um... Them, them little peanuts if you got them. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, sir. No problem. I'll be right yeah. there. Yeah. Thank you, love. I appreciate that. What you looking at? You thought I was gonna stay that knowing it was a hurricane on the way? Hell no. The damn rapture is coming and you expect me to be at work? <laughs> I'm on vacation. Somebody about to get dead, and I ain't about to be one of them. I know what you're thinking. But what about the people that don't know it's a hurricane coming? They about to find out. All right, then. <laughs> don't ask me. Ask Siri. She tell you. Are you ready to give this city the best weather report days I've ever seen? Blah, blah, blah. <clears throat> Please make sure to contact your local authorities immediately as police are still looking for the subject. Sub oh, ah. I've just been informed that, that, that there is... Ah! If you look here behind me, you can see that the storm is moving rapidly in our, in our, damn it, rapidly in our direction. But if we were to evacuate, who would keep you up to date on the storm? I'm gonna say. <laughs>